A team mascot is supposed to fire up the crowd, but the sidekick for Adirondack Flames is being extinguished. It was just a few days ago that the hockey team unveiled Scorch as the new mascot, but some people thought the idea behind his big reveal was in poor taste. Well, now Scorch is being stamped out. Houston ABC's Rachel Yankunas has more from Glens Falls. Hockey fans tell me they have a feeling the Adirondack Flames will bring the heat here on the ice of the Civic Center, but they say they didn't know they'd be taking the heat. Now, I have to say it was hard to find some people that found that skit controversial, but when I did, those critics might surprise you. After what some say is a controversial unveiling skit, the Adirondack Flames tell me they have extinguished their mascot. In the skit, Scorch the Flame takes on a firefighter and wins, reportedly taking after an 1864 fire that destroyed much of Glens Falls. Mayor Jack Diamond tells me that upset a few. I got a call that morning after it was released from the uh, chief of the fire department saying that he was getting comments about that. Um, but I didn't take it as a personal insult. The flames now in the market for a replacement. But when I showed the video to people, they didn't see an issue. Do you think that's controversial? What's your first reaction when you see that video? I think people are blown away out of proportion. It really doesn't seem offensive in any way to me, really. Just watching it, it just seemed kind of silly. I think it's fine. I don't see a problem with it. However, kids see it differently. They tell me they see a bad guy winning. It's just like the flame knocking over the firefighter. I think that was just a little bit like, I don't know, like I thought the firefighter would knock over the flame. I would actually want to see like the firefighter using like water to spray over the flame. You'd rather see the, the firefighter win? Yeah. Does he look like a superhero or does he look like an evil guy? He does. Okay, that's the uh, jury verdict. <laughs> right. Now I asked the team's president for a comment. He told me he did not want to answer any of my questions, but the team did apologize after their skit got poor reviews. And as I said, they are on the hunt for a new mascot, but they will not have one by their home game here on Thursday. I did ask those kids for some suggestions, and they say they like to see something involving fun and games. Reporting in Glens Falls, I'm Rachel Yankunas, News 10, ABC.